What do you want? Where? What do you want? Because that's it. You <laughs> Your feet just hit the floor. Are you hungry? You. Yeah, your feet just hit the floor. Are you hungry? Ruby. Yeah. <laughs> it's barely breaking daylight, y'all. I told you, the minute this kid's feet hits the floor, he comes to tell me sausage and eggs. It ain't no lie. He's hungry the minute he, when he wakes up. <laughs> uh, I have my coffee already, so I guess I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking. I usually tell him I need my coffee first, son. You know, he'll say five minutes. I'll see you in about five minutes. So, what time is it? Oh, it's 7.50. We about to start breakfast. Breakfast? Yeah. What about, watch this. What about pancakes and bacon? Yeah. Yeah, that'll work this morning. We might do pancakes and bacon. Good afternoon, you guys. We had a busy morning, so we started this vlog out this afternoon. Me and... Me and Farmer Jane are going to the grocery and we figured we'd take you guys along with us. Cece, show them you overalls. Turn around to see the front. I found those. I found those at Royal King over the summer on clearance. They must have been from the year before for $20. And she's finally able to wear them today. Hey, I can see that. <laughs> I didn't want to do it again, Mom. Tell them we're at the grocery store. Okay. We're at the grocery store. Right here. <laughs> We're at the grocery store. <laughs> We're at the grocery store. Oh, my stomach's hurting. I already went food. Okay, let's go get some groceries. Wait, don't forget about me. Well, we'll get one over here. Look. We get over here. Yeah, we'll get a buggy from over here. Mom, can I get in it first? You want to get in it? Right. Well, I want to get it back in here. Okay, you want to get the big part? Yeah. Let mommy pull it back up. Let's see. Banana and watermelon. That's it, mama. Well, we got to get some potatoes, too, ma'am. You can get potatoes, too. I just want that. And Let's a see. That's potatoes. Potatoes. Potato. I want mango. This no, that's onions. Okay, let me get the onions. <laughs> get us a bag of onions. Thank you. I'm strong to carry stuff. You are strong. Mom, I gotta get apples. Look, they got apples. No, I get apples too. Mom, hmm? carry it Honey, this is too heavy. Way too heavy. See how good I can stack all this stuff with all the crap we've got in the back of our car. Time to clean the summer trunk out. See if I can make it happen. Okay, I intended to film in there so much longer than I did, you guys, but we live in a small town, and I always run into people I know, and we always chit-chat for a second, so. But uh, that was a small little grocery haul anyways. Just, um, I got some spaghetti for dinner, uh, maybe tonight or tomorrow night, Mom? and then I got some chicken thighs, some potatoes, some onions, Mommy? bananas, yes. Are we going at that store? Uh, no, we have to go to another store. Mom? I got to the car and realized I forgot to get a case of water. And I also forgot to get RL8. I got the kids drinks in there. So I've got to run across the road over here. And um, they didn't have mine and Sean's L8. We like to drink anyhow. So I gotta run over to Food City and grab a case of water and a case of pop. And then we are done and heading back to the Hacienda. I'm trying to think of what I'm gonna cook tonight. And I guess I'll just see what the whole family wants. But I got some garlic bread and spaghetti. Never tried that sauce before, that brand. So we'll see how that goes. But um, I myself would love to have some chicken thighs and fried potatoes. But you know, the crew might not be down for that tonight. So, but we are having it one day this week. It's always Sean and the kids against me. I guess my taste buds are a lot different from theirs. But anyhow, let's head over here, get our water, our pop. And I'm pretty sure 
mom brain and all, I got everything I need for a couple days, I think. You know how that goes. I'll get home and be like, I almost forgot dishwashing liquid. I remembered at the very end and had to go back and get it. You ready to roll, sister? Yes. Been calling her Farmer Jane in her overhauls like Farmer daddy. Farmer Jane. Farmer Jane. Sean, y'all know he used to. He don't wear them as much anymore, but he used to wear his overalls all the time, coveralls, Farmer whatever. Farmer Jane. Y'all call him, I call him Farmer John. So she said, I'm like daddy. I said, okay then, Farmer Jane. Don't judge me on how dusty my uh, little thingy thing is here, y'all, but look. Oh, listen, I love me some summertime, but listen, fall, fall and spring are my favorites. It is a crisp and perfect 69 degrees today. It feels wonderful and I'm here for it. I have been beyond ready for a little bit of fall weather because we have had a very humid um, summer in Kentucky. I mean, it's just like you walk outside, you take a shower, you walk outside, and you've took another shower because it was just the air felt wet. So, I'm here for it. And you know what? What is it? <sighs> like the 20th of August or so. Listen, September the 1st. I I'm getting my fall stuff out within the next week. The 1st, my fall stuff is going up. And I know Sean's going to be so excited about that, but he's going to help me dig it out. It's time. I'm ready for some apple cinnamon candle tarts. I'm ready for some pumpkins sitting around my house. It's time, ain't it, Cece? It is, ain't it? I already got my two pumpkin pillows that my mom got me on my couch. So, that was like, it, that was Sean's hint. It's almost time. I know he just loves getting all my Dad, decorations can I go up for me. Maybe for a little bit? Uh, not today. We're going to go home, okay? Mommy's got to take the groceries home. We might go see Nanny tomorrow, okay? That's a good idea. All right, let's take these groceries home. Okay, we are back home, and I got all the groceries unpacked on the kitchen table. I'm going to show y'all my small little grocery haul. Didn't need too much. Needed more to add things to what I already have. And a couple meals. Like, I didn't have spaghetti sauce and things like that. But anyhow, let me show you what I got. Got eggs. Just went ahead and got some more to add to it because my house... They eat a lot of eggs, so eggs, bologna, I already got bread just for sandwiches, fried bologna in the mornings, the kids like that. Got bacon, sausage, um, chicken thighs, I already got the shredded cheese, so I got some broccoli, and we'll do some garlic bread with that too, or maybe biscuits, I don't know. But some grapes and some bananas. Got this bag has apples, oranges, and bananas in it. Got some potatoes. Might do some potato soup. I've got the bacon. I got cream cheese. Um, I got milk. So I might do some potato soup this week. I don't know. It just depends on if everybody in my house will eat it. Got a bag of onions. Got um, some wieners and macaroni and cheese for the kids' lunch one day and a pizza. And I got cucumbers in the fridge for a lunch another day. Just got some snack chips. And these I just needed to put back in my stock because it's getting low so I grabbed a little bottle of dishwashing liquid some sandwich bags got some mushrooms um I've got brown gravy packets my child y'all Colton Wayne absolutely loves Salisbury steak and brown gravy so might do that it's just sitting there it doesn't go with pork chops but got some pork chops probably just do some fried potatoes with that got hamburger meat and the four cheese sauce we've never tried garlic bread the noodles for that got one of these maybe for lunch too for the kids when we get done with school this week if they want it i don't see why they wouldn't but we're gonna try it and just got these to put back in my stock back up some canned corn canned green beans and sweet potatoes and a box of macaroni and cheese and that is it now i gotta put all this stuff up y'all i had to show you so i pulled all my shirts out of the closet like the ones that was deep down in my laundry basket in the closet, just to rewash them, refreshing them up. I'm filming. If y'all heard Sean say, I gotta poop, I gotta poop, not my fault. But anyhow, I found this shirt. This shirt, you guys, is pre-kids. So it's probably at least seven, eight years old. But the hillbilly and the wife, check us out on YouTube. Like... Come on. It was just in the bottom of my laundry basket. Pumpkin, are you okay? You eat too fast, didn't you? 
Uh-huh, you ate too fast. You gotta slow down. You gotta, look at your wrinkles. It ain't like you're starving. You gotta slow down when you eat. But I just figured I would show you guys that because, man, I haven't, gosh, it's probably, I have not worn this, I want to say three years, probably. But I wanted to show you guys. Breakfast. So do y'all remember the other day when my so kind husband gave me kraut juice to drink? Yeah, me too. Well, since he was so nice, I'm gonna serve him breakfast. Angry style. Here you go. I don't know where she's eating. You ready for bye bites? Yeah. You hungry? What are we having? Are you okay? What do you want? Breakfast. What do you want? I don't know. Food. One, two, ten. Um, uh, why are you doing this? Uh, maybe. One piece of bacon? Are you okay? Did you have a dream? Oh, don't let me forget to open your pop for you. Let me, let me open your pop for you. Oh, don't, how could I forget? Are you okay? So you don't get angry on your shirt. <laughs> Did you dream that I cheated on you again? I swear. Megan, it was a dream. What is the issue? Like the cover. No, 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 Megan, I won't be. There you go. I can't eat that, man. What did I do? What'd you give me to drink the other day? Crap juice. That ain't got nothing to do with like over peppered eggs Enjoy that I ain't your even, breakfast. I ain't even eating. So I came home from grocery shopping and Sean already had these laid out. So I'm not sure what sides we're making with them. I was thinking, where is it? Where's it at? I was thinking about making these with it. Both of my kids love these. And maybe just some green beans or mustard greens. Sean really loves his mustard greens. The kids don't care for it, but Sean likes it, so. Might do the potato, that box of potatoes, or I might do some fried potatoes. I don't know. I gotta see what everybody wants, but I guess we are having ribs. I think that's what that was. But I wanted to show you guys this. Look at my pumpkin pillows, y'all. How cute. I got two of them. Hobby Lobby. I wanted to show you guys these, though. So 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 good my mom got uh me and her one from qvc because me and her are both snackers and she's like i got you one too because i know you're like your mama and like to snack my children is like me they like to snack like y'all i cook because of my my husband and my kids if it was left up to me i could snack my way through life i know that's why i've gained 10 pounds this summer i gotta lose this belly but they have got sesame seeds in them. They've got um, like barbecue, like a little harder than barbecue Fritos, uh, raisins, almonds, peanuts. It has got a ton of stuff in it and that will last a good long time. I sit here for probably 30 minutes just snacking on it after I got my food and stuff put away. <clears throat> Didn't even bring it down just a tiny little bit. Cece was eating on it too. But yeah, that, that right there, if y'all snackers, want a healthy snack get you some i think she said qvc i'm pretty sure is where she got that <clears throat> let me tell you something my belly hurts we all know listen we are vlogging again which means the camera's gonna be on in the house a lot more he come running through the hallway i gotta poop i gotta poop i gotta poop so they all know you had to poop i had to poop I mean, I ain't ashamed of it. It's a human function that we all do. 
Well, you don't have to announce it. Well, I did. Listen, what is that in the sink? Ribs? Spare ribs. What I thought got? about putting them in the pressure cooker and getting them pretty much done. Yeah, because they're then, still frozen right now and it's three, so. Well, I was going to take them out to the grill and throw a little char on them, you know, coat them with butter a little bit. That way it flames up good and then throw a little barbecue sauce on them like I did that one time. But what sides are we going to have? Sweet potatoes for me. That's Listen, carnivore diet, you know, I've seen the comments that you guys... Yeah, are, a couple y'all did want Sweet potatoes know. are a lot better than regular potatoes. Regular yeah. potatoes I can't eat. I said that in the last video. And pasta, it's just I can't do it. Right. Well, see, Sean, he also... He does the meat and the eggs, but he also eats a lot of bananas. He eats a lot of berries, like blueberries, raspberries, strawberries. strawberries. He eats a lot of nuts, too. Here, what are them nuts we here, can keep in by the containers in there? Pecans. He eats beef jerky, too. You it's, know. It's, it's basically, everybody it's, was saying the Atkins, it's not the Atkins. It's no. more of a paleo if it comes from the earth. Right. And you know, if it's, it's Sort of natural, whole foods plus little animal. I, I, it's cut out processed. Yeah. It's, processed is poison. It's basically right. cutting out processed. But we have noticed on, on a serious note here, Sean, for about the last year, if he eats... Um, a lot of potatoes say i make homemade mashed potatoes or if we eat spaghetti like he literally crashes okay. after he eats it he gets sleepy and weak feeling he's gonna have to go to the doctor soon eventually he's trying to before we have to go uh, make an appointment eventually he's trying to figure it out with food and cut a lot of things out but he it, we're wondering if it's maybe not his sugar you know, because pasta, breads... It all turns to carbs, which turns yeah. into And it sugar. just really runs his battery down. And Sean does have some family members that are, what is it, type 1? It's diabetics. not the... No, I've got... Some of my family members actually have to take insulin... Every day. Every day. Yeah. Hi. Hi. I'm trying to catch it before it gets to that. Yeah. I mean, he's... Look at him. He's got gray hair and everything now. So he's got a... He's like if it's going to go gray, I wish it just Hi. all go right here so it would look cool. Hi, Mommy. It, well, that's kind of where it... Hi, Hi baby. Mama. Hi. Are you missing your Bubba? Yeah. 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 <laughs> we had to take the pink coveralls off, y'all, because... Uh -oh. Before we got home, she done had black stripes down the front of them. I don't... I guess that was from the buggy. <laughs> And then when we got home, Sean decided to give her her Nutella treat. Uh, it was and partially way open when she handed it to me, so I assumed you handed it. This, this girl of mine, I always thought my boy would be ten mm -hmm. times messier. Nope, it's it's definitely Nutella. My daughter. There is no more. So, mommy, bring some. Bring you done some. ate it. No. Yes, you, you did. did. Now listen, no more sweet stuff until um, probably tomorrow. No, you, have you had a sucker, and you had um, the Nutella and the pretzel sticks, and a couple Tic Tacs. So, I think that's. Good. I've told mommy one sweet treat a day, and that's it. It's like mommy. We cheated. have to watch it with her. Shh, like she would live. Colton. Colton's like I, I don't you. like sugar very much. Yeah, Colton's, Colton's like, just his, like me. He's like Hi, no, Mama. you are were the sugar con the connoisseur. Mommy, hey. I, Hi, I am the one. I've always been preferred salty over sweet my entire life. This one right here, we got to reel her back a little bit because she would live on nothing but sugar. I'm going to be real now. Right. Sugar to me tastes like artificial sweetener. I cannot stomach the taste of it. Artificial sugar, don't nobody comment about these artificial sweeteners. I cannot hack them. Yeah, listen. It'll make me sick. Like, there was a gum I ate one day. Remember that? And I got sick in my stomach from the artificial. I cannot when you back off of a lot of that stuff and then reintroduce sugar in, like, like, everything is overwhelming. Like, you realize, like, holy smokes, you know, everything is so sweet. Now, we but, bought that sugar in the raw, and that's not bad. Now, my pop gives me more than enough, my LA, more than enough of my daily dose of sugar. But other than that, and my cream or my coffee, I don't really eat sugar. I get it with my cream or my coffee in the mornings and my pops. That's it. And, you know, some of the foods I eat, but... I don't just like 
my little Chloe, she would be like all day cakes, ice cream, sugar, candy. I know. get my sweets from Cold ain't now. like it. He likes his meat, his eggs, his fruit, you know. Colton likes sausage and egg. Duh. That's it. Like, if you ask him what he wants to eat 24-7, sausage egg. Sean will tell me, don't do Groundhog Day every day on the vlogs. You, are you okay? Would you do me a favor, real quick? Go in there and tell them about that jellyfish light because there's like 400 comments. Oh, y'all want to know about the jellyfish light? I can hook you up. I can hook you up. You love it? Yeah. It's obviously in the kitchen because of my kids. They both help me cook a lot, so they like to sit up here on the counter. Right here it is, you guys. We found it at Super Walmart back where the TVs are, the um, video games, all that stuff, electronics. It was only $15. It has been going for what, Sean? Two or three months? Yeah, it's been going a while. It's been going all summer and still going. Now, it does the multi-light too, but then you can just do solid colors. Colton's favorite's right there. It literally looks like jellyfish in the ocean. You know when you go like, um, what's, Here's what's weird, the though. aquarium in Gatlinburg? That literally looks like some of the jellyfish tanks. You have to put dish soap in it to actually get it to work right. Just a drop. Don't overdo it because he overdone it on the first well, try. Well, I've noticed though I've done it the same way and it stayed cloudy for a whole day and then cleared up. It does. Yeah. But they won't move. Don't know why, but you have to drop a drop of dishwashing liquid in there and it takes it till the next day before they really start swimming. They won't swim, move around without the dish soap. I don't know. I don't understand it just the way it is. But uh, if y'all get one, Super Walmart, they're like 15 bucks. And uh, make sure one tiny little drop of dish soap. Don't overdo it. We gotta it. <laughs> warn them of this though. Because yeah. it's just We would that. be filling that back up constantly. Yeah, well, we'd have wet spots in the floor. But the kids love it, so that's why we decided to put it right here in the kitchen. Poor Mamma. Poor Mamma, she's having a hard day. I'm going back home, I'm home. Why do you gotta go home? Because Sean's mom's dog is named Saki, and when she leaves, so you know, sometimes she's like, "I gotta go let the dog out to pee." She just Chloe came through here a while ago with her, uh, came through here a while ago with her with them walkers, and just said that out of the blue. I thought it was so cute. I had to show y'all. But anyhow, Sean is finishing the ribs up right now. We went easy peasy, y'all. I don't know what it is. Anytime I go to the grocery store and have to even get a little bit, I don't feel like. I done potatoes, I ain't gonna lie. I done these instead of peeling potatoes like I always do. I keep a couple of these on hand for tired nights like that, but grocery shopping day, I just don't feel like doing all that. Y'all know how it is. What are you doing? You playing Mamma? <laughs> I told you. That is the physical manifestation of my brain. I told y'all, I wasn't doing nothing special with the ribs, no kind of recipe, so I really didn't show it. I just threw them in our Ninja Foodie on pressure for about 30 minutes, and then I took them out to the grill. I ain't showing you my grill, because we need a new grill. This one's on its last leg in a heartbeat. It's like six years old, so. Just threw them on there, slather little barbecue sauce on them man ain't them looking good though mm. hi kids <laughs> hi kids what's the matter <laughs> now mamma don't fall like that you need help here Mamma, if that's how you get around, we're gonna have to put you in the old folks' home. I know it, I know it. She you got your mamma today? She mimics me quite a bit. <laughs> She's got it down pat. Even though it's gotta leave the speed socky or let the socky go pee. I guess he's joined in the fun now. What are you doing?
Are we gonna have to give Mamma a walker? Oh, there goes Saki to pee. <laughs> Grab Bubba's hand. That's great. Yes. Lord bless this food and bless the world. Find the ones that can't find a meal tonight, Lord, and give them a meal. Lord, and give us peace at this table and peace in this house. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Yeah, good job.